So, this is quite possibly the final stream of Subsurface Circular. It will be the final stream of tonight, that's for fucking sure. It is about half nine. I got past uh, the first stream way faster than I thought I was. The last stream was uh, Weird Itchio Games. And... I was ex I was I was hoping that would take like maybe two hours, but no, it took less than that because half the games were either um, slower than I thought, or what what I mean by that, um, they were faster than I thought. Sorry, or they didn't work. So, like I said, we're playing Subsurface Circular tonight. I googled it last time after I played it last time, and it said it was about two hours long, and I played it for one hour and a bit last time. So, we'll play it for however long it's got left I you know we'll pl I'll play it for a maximum of two hours till about 12 ish or half 11 ish um and if it's not finished by then well then it's not finished by then <laughs> chat member does my audio sound okay Uh, there you have it, chat. You got a seizure warning right there. Oh, they left. Well, I guess I'm alone. <laughs> oh, also, we'll be playing um, a game called Sub Rosa tomorrow, and I'll be streaming that with one of my friends. Um, and that's an online game where you play as businessman. And you just dick around, essentially. <laughs> you have to, like, bargain with other car uh, other people who are playing the game. Alright, continue. Oh! Immediately. Right into the game. Right, so what was I doing? Blue shell. Disappearances. So, Psy101. Row 67. Initiate private link up. Hi. Hello, dear. Am I disturbing you? Are you free to talk? Mind if I ask you some questions? Not at all. My assignment was just terminated. What were you assigned? I don't really have to not have time to listen to your troubles, Tech. Well, yeah. We'll be nice. I'm a nanny. I help otherwise engaged humans to look after and raise their children. I had been working for a politician watching over their sweet boy. I had been working for a pol- I had been working for a politician watching over their sweet little boy, Ansa, but apparently my position was embarrassing publicly, so I have been removed from the assignment. I am heading to fabrication to be reprogrammed. How is a tech nanny embarrassing? They're reprogramming you? They're just reprogramming you? Politics. Nah, yeah, they're just reprogramming you. That's kind of fucked. Because these are like sentient as well. That's right. Humans aren't that aren't pro tech do that if they no longer serve a purpose, especially in the current climate. I hope Ansa deals with the change as well. I hope Ansa deals with the change well. Do you work with humans much? I tend to focus more on text, which brings me to my focus today. I'm investigating rumors of a tech of tech disappearances. May I ask you some questions? Of course, but I need your help for it. Fuck's sakes! I need to change the to the outer line to get to fabrication. Do you know the first Do you know the first stop to get on that? Thanks so much, dear. I may get off earlier. Alright, cool. I can ask her the questions now. Disappearances. Do you know anyone who disappeared? Oof. Not personally, no, but I've heard rumors. Very scary. 
my former employer warned me off of late night warned me off of late night subsurface travel and to avoid strange texts of course I'm breaking both those rules now that I've been left at her employment you think I'm strange I didn't tell you told me you were a detective. Knowing management sent you here makes me feel safer. I took the case on my own. Yes, they sent me. <laughs> it's good to see you on the case, officer. You said you're being reprogrammed. Right, suspicious behavior. Spotted any suspicious... <laughs> suspicious events. No. No, my job kept me topside and largely away from tech, from other techs. I suppose the only char change you'll be seeing is more of my kind riding the subsurface on our way to reprogramming and reassignment as our visibility in the human world becomes a liability. Protech is linked to the general human discontent. Odd, eh? Like being pro-computer or pro-automobile, human anger at our sort has manifested in a lot of ways. Not... <laughs> has manifested in a lot of ways, not least the HPC working for a politician appears to have put me on the block. HPC. What is HPC? Do you not follow politics? The Human Political Cooperative. They are anti-tech politician movement lobbyists that don't like us very much. Why not? Because AI and the singularity. Do you think we're foreign invaders? I've heard them use the word invaders. We take jobs. NEED TO JOBS! We take jobs that historically belong to them. We require upkeep and expensive infrastructure like this train we're currently riding. But we do so much to their economy. Right, ah, oh, I can't do that. But we do so much to their economy. We do their, the jobs they want. Yeah, I say that. That's a discussion I've never really gotten into. Turing. Okay, so that is. Uh, I don't think it's the same type of person. I don't think it's the same type. Fuck it. Hack! I'm an. I am a recall model. None of those excess works will work on me until I'm back in fabrication. We were having a nice chat, don't spoil it by trying to reprogram me. Ah. Oh. You said you're being reprogrammed. Can you not stay as a nanny? What kind of human parent wants a tech to raise their child? That's all I can... I was hoping I could just hack. I could if work was available but I'm not sure that it will be in the coming months. Lots of my colleagues got similar marching orders today and politics is a key sector for us. What kind of human parents wants to talk to? Okay, that. You're very kind. So I've just talked to her. This fucker is just listening to music. So, psychiatrist. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Hello, hello, are you busy? How are you? Tell me what I'm thinking. <laughs> How are you? I'm okay. You're less verbose than many of the texts I've talked to. Boring answer. Mm. A habit of my kind, I'm a psychiatrist. Psychiatrists don't talk much. I feel like you're wasting my time. No. Psychiatrists don't talk much. We tend to listen. May I ask you some questions? 
on a detective and investigating a spate of disappearances. And you want help? Ideally. Hmm. Yes, yes, I suppose that could work. Of text? Yes, but not first hand. Tell me about, okay, uh, suspicious events. A professional witness to a great many things, strange things, mostly human things, though nothing about, nothing what, nothing that a tech would be interested in. Largely things related to parents. It's almost always because of the parents. <laughs> Tell me about psychiatry. Human disconduct. Do discontent, sorry. Do humans tell you much about their discontent with techs? Yes, they're scared of us. It's led to a surge in psychiatry work. Psychiatry work primarily done by techs. <laughs> it's like um that that uh the phobia it, it's like the phobia of big words is like a big fucking word. It's like a massive word. Why are they scared? Yeah. I have a head. I've had a headache all day and I don't know why. It's really bothering me. Because we are noble, because popular uh, entertainment products often frame us as dangerous, because we do their jobs and we do them better. Because humans are afraid of things because we don't have faces. Why don't we have faces? They think we're dangerous. Why don't we have faces? Good idea. Ask that. Are you familiar with the uncanny valley? No. I think I am, but I'm gonna say no. It's a term used to describe early attempts to make human-like text. As they became more realistic, they began, began to discuss humans. Humans parse things that look almost like humans as dead bodies or monsters. Yeah, I, I, I know about that. It was decided that Tex would not have faces because anything less than perfect would make humans uncomfortable interacting with us. They react badly. I'm sure they're fine with us. Right, badly, precisely. It makes things harder for humans to care for our well-being. Human on tech violence, for a commonplace, for example. HPC, human on tech violence. Do these? Do you think a violent human could be the one behind the disappearances? It's possible. A human who has particularly frustrated with the existence of text. Who was part? A human who was particularly frustrated with the existence of text would see it as an act of sustained vandalism, not murder. Tell me about psychiatry. Goodbye, HPC. I don't think I can reprogram him, so I'm not gonna bother. Have you heard of the human protect? Oh shit! Sorry about the mic there. Have you heard of the Human Protection Co Cooperative? Yes, a political party or a terrorist group, I forget which. Tell me about psychiatry. Right, well, I can't reprogram them, I don't think, so. Why? Because I want to know, because learning is fun. <laughs> because my night, because my night off is off to a very odd start, and to be honest, I think your profession could be of some help. We should talk about that further. Psychiatry is the art of human support. My role is to listen to humans' problems. There are myriad, myriad challenges. Humans process problems through describing them. I listen, it helps. Sounds valuable. An odd job. How self-indulgent of them. I 
how does that make you feel? I'm sorry, psychiatrist. <laughs> I can't talk to him anymore. Do you ever go to the theater? How's your night going? We're done, I suppose. He's not gonna hear me. They never hear you. Oh! Someone else got on. Lover. Oh, she a sex robot? Hello, your indicator says lover. I guess you're occupied. Hi, I'm better. Tell me, better. Have you seen my love? I sit here waiting. <laughs> Mind answering a few. Okay, I'm a detective. The lonely heart cannot hear questions, it is deafened by the silence of a world without its object. There's not... Oh, fucking... I'm sorry, my brain is being a dick. The lonely heart cannot hear questions, it is, it is deafened by the silence of a world without its object. Does not the songbird stand mute? in the moment of abandonment. Flowery language. Ah, that's what poetry is. It's flowery language. I feel like maybe you're not going to be maybe help. This is getting old fast. Flowery language. Truth Lavender hung up on the copper coil. So you can't help. You will answer me, citizen. So you can't help. Not until my love returns, not until my loneliness is sated. I want to step away for a moment. I'm gonna see if I can hack her. I care only for the movements of one and you're oh, okay. Oh, someone else got in the train, cool. Can I hack her? Yes. Not until your love is here. Yes, the sound streams through the window. I'm enlightened. You're glowing. I'd like to have a conversation. I know nothing beyond romance. Subject, my love. Oh, fucking hell. Unless the glitch has returned. The glitch? My love suffers from a language glitch. If it occurs, I can't. I can fix it with remote language reset. But I need the oh fuck. I can fix it with remote remote language reset. But I need their permission. We have a three letter code. Learn it, and I can help. I care only for the moon. Okay, cool. So I, I gotta get her uh, code so she can help me. So this person is the same. Pi4, he's a listener. Comms. Chai13. Fix the glitch. Calm. Okay. Hello, I'd like to talk to you about my investigations. Hmm? Oh, he's a fucking beatboxer. Activate guided deduction. I need help. Guided deduction activated, communication glitching will be analyzed for clues. Wait, what? D.
D B U D D B U. Right, I'll try that on her. D B U D. D. Ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Where were we, my dear? Apparently jobs in psychiatry are on the rise. Could you be tasked for you? <sighs> yes, that would fit. Thank you. It would be fantastic to keep trying to help those who need it. I'll ask for that reassignment and fabrication. What kind of human parent wants attack? Human on tech violence? Are you afraid of human on tech violence? Humans are uh, blah, blah, blah. humans are reliably prone to anthropomorphic bias. By personality and aesthetic are designed to encourage sympathy and trust. When they turn violent, it's more often than not towards techs more linked to action. Action, sports techs, peacekeepers, low-level fabrication, the jocks of the tech world, or so humans perceive them. What kind of human, what kind of human parent is that? Yeah. A busy one. Nannies, so what kind of human type we want? To, yeah, yeah. A busy one. Nannies have existed for a long time. The only new part is text being assigned to the role. Humans value the upbringing of a child. There's no shame in them asking for help. Thanks, I'll let you know if I need anything help. Uh, if I need help. Oh, fuck. Hey, my headache's gone. Hint. The comms tech appears to be glitching letters. Maybe there's some kind of pattern you could figure... Okay, so I need to talk to the comms tech then. So, D... Okay, so D. Okay, so D. So D, 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 B, U. Okay, so D D D B U. It's been interesting. D D D B U. B isn't here, so U. D, 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 B, U. I don't fucking know. Dud. D. U.
Oh, uh, this is too much. I'm just gonna look it up. Fuck this. I'm lazy. Lover bot subsurface circular code. Accept all cookies, subsurface circular human resources, code and puzzle. Sorry, I'm quiet. I'm just reading this. My head is... Why is my head sore when I start to read? Play 13 minutes to run down the options until you have, have to back out, speak again, and select the top option until session of glitch appears following ask the three-letter code. If this doesn't appear, chat to the another tech and return until it does. You need one prior conversation before you can start this part. You have to enter the letters based on is it C A T for example. Based on what you got from the glitch outcomes chai thirteen. For us, it would be DBU, so one character lower is C, A, and then T, for example. Okay, so it's C, A, T, then it has to be C, A, T. Please say that's it. Cat, yes, my love adores cats. That's our code word. I have reset the language processors. They should be able to. Sorry, I did that. Like I just couldn't be arsed because my head's got a fucking headache. So, you know, why would I go through a puzzle? I just want to play a story. Cat, yes, my love adores cats. That's a code word. I have reset their language processors. They should be able to help now. You now. In the meantime, can I help with anything? I'm going to step away for a moment. Disappearances. Nothing. Nil. Human disconduct. Unknowable. HPC. I have not. Human attack violence. No. I'm going to step away for a moment. I can only for the moment. Okay. Do I gotta like wait or something? Alright, cool. So. Oh, hello, my name is Beta1. I think your language processor should be working now. It is, thank you. I know you have questions, I'd like to answer them, but as you can see, I'm otherwise occupied by your lover bot, but I helped you, I suppose, but being detective has no effect. But by your lover bot, that's right. My companion is of the greatest importance to me. I lead a difficult life in the city, so I find an opportunity. So finding an opportunity like this is this to spend quality time is difficult. I never understood the point of such in uh, I get it, I was young once. I don't don't make me take you to the station. <laughs> We're going downtown. I got it, I was young once. Oh 
Youth is irrelevant when you find the right tech for you. You're, you'll understand. And you won't speak to me while your love is present. I bet you'd speak to me if that other tech wasn't here. Ooh, I could sound ominous or I could ask a nice question. I will not. Not even a little bit? No. Okay. Better than okay. It's been interesting. <sighs> Dickhead. Right. Hint. Do we already know a way to force text to leave the subsurface circular? I can't remember. Yes. No. Turing. <laughs> Forsooth, dost thou linger elegant? <laughs> <laughs> no need for sarcasm, my language modifiers are deactivated. I apologize, you should return to normal when you go back to ground level. You're free! <laughs> An inconvenience, I must reset. I cannot express my love properly in this mode. I'll get off at the next station. Yes! Hacker man! You appear to be alone. <laughs> Just be smug about it. Oh, that's great. Yes, my partner needs to step away for a moment. We'll meet later at a waypoint. A bar? That's right. Forgive me, that's a human bar, isn't it? The bar? For me, that's a human bar, isn't it? Does one of you drink? I've not encountered that before. You Don't you get rusty? I'm more of an... Um, I'm more of an entertainment module, alpha and chill sort of tech. <laughs> alpha and chill sort of tech. <laughs> we like the music. And the bar techs are happy to indulge a couple, not ordering anything, making googly eye optics at each other in the corner. Some people are less intimidated by love than you are. Oh, you dick. I'm sorry, you're right. I've been incredibly rude, I apologise. What do you do when you're not canoodling? Right, I'll uh, I'll I'll talk nice to him so I can get information. Not a problem. I'm a communications tech. I deal with the stress techs calling management every day. Management, even down here. That's right. I have a twenty-four hour link. Why are you talking to me? Do you need oh new objective uploading files findings to management? I'm a detective investigating some disappearances. I need to upload my findings. I don't think I can leave the subsurface just yet, but I have important data for management. That'd be nice. I'll do this one. Absolutely. You're ready now? I think so. Let's do this. Now I need to investigate the human aspect of the case further. Sure. Your objective notification appears to disagree. You likely need to gather more information on the subject. Human element, whatever that means. You had questions? It's been interesting. Right, disappearances. And actually ask him the questions I need now. You know the same rumours as everyone else, you know. I don't think I ever met anyone who knew a missing tech. I suppose there's no many, there's so many of us down here that many can fall through the cracks before anyone notices. Suspicious events. Have you seen anything strange down here? No, well, apart from a detective convincing my partner to leave the carriage, don't think I didn't see you talking to them. You dick. Can I fucking just override him? I doubt it. Humans distrust us? 
They certainly do. Human attack violence. I tend to stay out of their way, but yeah, once. A child on the street couldn't have been older than 13. Threw a stone at my back, I still have a dent. You never got it fixed? Should have thrown it right back at them. You may be misunderstanding the strength of the, these chassis. I'm ready to upload my findings. HPC. I saw vids of one of their protests once. Scary stuff. They had tech heads on sticks. I'm sure they were off a factory line somewhere, never activated, but still grisly. I hope I never run into one. If you keep going to human bars, that could happen. Why should we alter our behavior for their benefit? Turing. Communicator attacks cannot be overridden. That would be an enormous security risk. I'm ready to upload my findings. Okay, let me establish a connection. Okay, cool. Your finding connection available. Please provide your findings in a compressed format for immediate upload. You're like, what the fuck? Or something. Information received but unauthorized investigation tech beta 1.1 is operating an investigation outside of pre-programmed pre parameters. Tech will remain in position for immediate intersect with... So information received but unauthorized investigation. Tech beta 1.1 is operating an investigation outside of pre-programmed parameters. Tech will remain in position for immediate intersect with investigation team assigned case 023 Gamma. I don't understand. Very strange. Message ends, apologies, no further information is available. I suppose you wait for the detectives to arrive. Thanks. Good luck. I'm gonna get fucking reprogrammed or some shit. Detection. Alright, cool. Sorry, I'm just adjusting the audio a little bit. Fabricator. Listener. Fucking fabricators, man. Or listeners. Listeners are practically useless. Hello there, tech. Hello. Your fabrication tech. I met one of your kind earlier this evening. You okay? Another tech, a few words. Lots of fabrication techs on subsurface, not lots of detectives though. You're different personality type. You're different from the fabrication tech I met earlier. I'm standard, run of the mill, exactly what I should be. Ah, makes sense. Something doesn't make sense. You see the red tech? Other fabrication techs you've met smarter. A little, yes, ooh. Yes, high medium intelligence. You're sure fabrication, most fabrication. You're sure fabrication, most fabrication techs at my level must have been special tech, human. Let's see, I, I can't read that. 
Eliasson. I don't know. I'm waiting for some detective text. Mind if I ask you a couple questions? Few questions, same thing. Yep. Might not know answers, probably won't. We'll try. Disappearances. I'm in the tech appearing business, haha. <laughs> business is good, protection pushed up, way up. Seen anything strange? No, see the factory, see the subsurface, see recharge vault. Small life, not much room for strange. Overproduction. HPC. He's not going to fucking know this. Overproduction. Why is production up? Don't know. Work with hands, but don't count fingers. H Himbo tech. Human tech violence. HPC. I will try and reprogram him if he doesn't fucking... Boss tech warn us to avoid them. Trouble risk of property damage. Human tech violence. I'm big tech. I'm a big tech. Easy target for humans who feel inferior. Asimov's laws make fighting one-sided. Happens every now and again. How's work? Work is making techs. Work is busy. Production pushed way up. <laughs> oh error tech has no higher function tech has no higher level communication routines resetting hello thank you for your time I was gonna say listener great another guy's getting on oh he's fucking off okay Are you gonna get on or? Oh, are these the detective bots? Yup. Well, shit. Are you beta 1 1? Lie. No, who's that? Uh, I am. Good. Answer my colleagues' questions. I need a moment. Take it. Are beta 1-1? One, one. I am. Good. We've been assigned to intercept you. Ooh. Avoid complications, detectives. I've not done it. We've been assigned to intercept you and ask you some questions. I've not done anything wrong. I'm just a detective like yourself following a case. Yes, our case. Oh. The case assigned to us by management weeks ago. And you're annoyed because I'm making progress you haven't. Ooh. <laughs> Let's be petty fucks. I highly doubt that. The, the upload you made was sloppy, directionless. We do, however, have some questions for you. I'm happy to help colleagues in need. Should I have a lawyer press? <laughs> Are you guilty of anything? Of course not. Good. So tell us about your case. You began, okay. You began it shortly after meeting a fabrication tech. That's right, they had lost a close friend and asked me to investigate. I felt pity and desire to do what I could find. Uh, yes, well, they met me, talked to me about their desire to be smarter, talked vaguely about missing friend. So vague, you decided to spend the last hour investigating them. Your investigation implies that these disappearances are real. It does. There are multiple missing texts. There's certainly a fear out there. That was your conclusion. When, then what happened? I engaged in my investigations, talked to as many texts as I could, as I could 
find on this train. I mostly kept to myself. Did you talk to any outsiders? Yes, one researcher, a useful perspective. I also see records of unauthorized access word use. Is that true? Once, but only because I had to. Really? It's disgusting. There's, there's a reason such methods are frowned upon by management. Only because they're... They like to keep that power to themselves. Their reasons are less important than my questions. I know better. Only because they like to keep that power to themselves. You seek power. I seek the one who is responsible for the disappearances. And who might that be? The red tech. Some kind of tech conspiracy management. The red tech. I think that, uh, mm, I don't know. I'm going to say the red tech. Nonsense. As your own records show, the red tech is only crops up. Oh, my PS4 went in rest mode. Okay. I agree that they are a suspicious figure, but killer of techs. No, you've lied to me. There are disappearances between your answers and your records you uploaded. It has not been noted. I have I answered all your... You have... You've lied to me. There are disappear, discrepancies between... Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. Yes. Tell my partner we're done here. Go on. How are you feeling? Calm. Stoic. Can I ask you some questions? No, in this mood, I prefer to be alone with my thoughts. How are you feeling? Okay. So, no, in this mood. Okay. Moment, please, officer. As I was saying, Answer my colleague's questions. I answered your partner's questions. Good. Can you answer mine? No. Why not? Your friend asked the, asked the questions. You don't answer them. So what do you do? I'm a support tech. My role is emotional stability. My partner's capacity to work relies on my mood. Their approaches are defined by my state. All right, then I can I can like hear my switch, and I'm like, hmm, why? <laughs> yeah, techs aren't supposed to have emotions. Oh, are we getting into? A fail-safe logical inquiry and emotional researching are too much for one tech to perform reliably without support. So why don't I have an emotional support tech? True, I'm doing just fine on my own. Because you're not assigned to emotionally straining cases. You elected to pursue these disappearances, which was foolhardy and that's why we're here to find out what you know and take you back to management. I'm pretty frustrated. How are you feeling? I'm good cam stoic as I am supposed to be. If I made you angry, would that upset? Would that make your partner angry too? I wish I could benefit from your calming abilities. Yes, but that won't happen. I'm stoic. How stoic? Ooh. <laughs> I'd love to talk to you about this case. I'd welcome the opportunity. Detectives. About your lo you love being a detective. Disappearances. So disappearance is eh, a bit sad. If 
they happened, yes, but I'm unconvinced at this time that they did. So, no emotional response, I'm afraid. Seen anything strange? Nothing, my mood remains unchanged. HPC. What's your view of the HPC? The human... That's right. Oh, get mad, get fucking mad, get, 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 get mad. I respect their right to have free assembly and debate. I love to see the human democracy in action and it gives me hope that one day... Fuck's sakes. Action and hope gives me hope that one day Tex will have a seat at that table. It makes me happy. Fuck's sakes. Human on tech violence over production. That's gonna be the subject. That has to be the subject to set them off. These texts are connected. Maybe you can dig deeper by Yeah. Unfortunately, yes, terrible business. It burns my solder to see a young tech. How do you feel? Tired of the ridiculous questions, you pathetic little tech. <laughs> He's fucking angry. I need a moment. Take it. You're back. Go on. How are you feeling? Angry, idiot. Yeah, gosh, I hope you <laughs> don't want to answer my questions. Oh, you'd like me to stay quiet, wouldn't you? <laughs> Hacked. Social engineering, bitch. Disappearances. I, kn I know more than you. I know that there are exactly 16 reported each week. Suspicious events. My face is a thing of beauty compared to that your fruit like face you have a face that looks like it has slammed face first into a concrete wall your face is the kind of face which makes me regret having optics if your face is a color it would be an ugly color that nobody likes parental faces parental faces tell their child faces horror stories about the face to make them brush their teeth your face is so flat, it needs all to... <laughs> 16. 16 seems high. Maybe for an impossibly stupid tech like you, I bet a decimal point would kill you. Let's test my theory. Point zero 0.01. Do nothing. Pity. Overproduction. Actually, yeah, I should probably ask that. I hear they're making more techs. Yeah, maybe you should switch yourself off to make more room for them. Oh, you dick. Human on tech violence. HPC. Why, are you a member? That'd be just like you joining an anti tech hate group, idiot. Human on tech violence. Any thoughts on human on tech violence? My thoughts are currently focused on tech on tech violence. <laughs> right, the only other way is to hack him and I'm not gonna do that. You sure you're a detective? I'm a better one than you ever were. Past tense, you'll see it, idiot. Architects above, you can't be stupid enough to try that. Alright, well, I've ans he's answered all my questions, so these tags are connected, yeah. How do you know that? Interesting, interesting. I am intrigued.
I feel the need to investigate. Hmm, see anything strange, nothing, my mood remains unchanged. But I already asked you! Fuck! It's not gonna work, but hey. You imprudent to calm my demeanor, my calm demeanor. I will tear your socket from plating. I will pull out every LED in your pathetic chassis. <laughs> it's brilliant, you? Yeah, fantastic. Oh, what am I supposed to do? Listener. They're always useless, man. Has a human ever hurt you? Only by refusing me a oh. <clears throat> What do you make of the HPC? A passing trend, humans are inherently nice. I'm sure they'll get past that roadblock. Disappearances, sorry if it brings you down. But do you know anything about these disappearances? I know there's not been many, which is definitely a glass half full situation in my book. Still less than seventeen. Got to look on the brightest side. On the bright side, you're looking very well polished today, by the way. If you don't mind me saying, buddy. Overproduction. So he's better. He's feeling a bit better now. Are they? How lovely. Suspicious events. See anything strange? The great thing about life is I always think it, I always think is the power of new strange experiences to support you. How are you feeling? Clearly weirdly happy. Happy. Everything's sort of fantastic, isn't it? I'm um, sure I ask you some questions. I cannot even begin to imagine anything I'd like more. Turing detectives. Any job is made easier by winning a by a winning attitude and a spring in one step. I process possess twenty seven springs in each foot. Oh, that's a pun. <clears throat> I admire your pluck, your vim, your vigor. I am, however, not susceptible to your cheeky plan. I need that a moment, officer. So I need to hack the other guy to make him, I guess, sad or something. Hello. How is things going, my guy? Kappa 4-3. Right, I need to like hack these cop bots. As I was saying, it's a fantastic, lovely... Okay, how do you feel? I need a moment. So clearly he's happy, so I need to hack him. Glowing, thank you for asking. Suspicious events, HTC, HBC, so... Overproduction detective, 16.
How do you know that? I'm interested. I'm intrigued. How do you feel? I feel the need to investigate. I need a moment. Okay, so if I talk to him now, will he be intrigued? You're back. Go on. How are you feeling? Inquisitive, I'm ready to get to the bottom of this case. This the case of me? Yes, tell me everything in your words. Disappearances, 16. Apparently there are 16 missing texts a week for two months, so that's possibly 128 murders total. Did I tell you that? I did, right. A different emotional state helps me process my thoughts. Apologies if I seem strange. Disappearances. I've been investigating disappearances. I've been a yeah. Yes, you picked up the case. Uh, yes, you picked up the ca a case got scurrying about this train carriage asking questions. But you're no closer than you were. Only more questions, eh? No new information. Frustrating? Yes, I'm sure. But I'm on the case now and we're going to work it out, I promise. Suspicious events. Everything about this case is strange. Agreed. HPC. A lot of human, a lot of techs are worried about the human protection cooperative. They're right to be, I suspect. Although, from our data, the risk appears much lower than the reputation implies. Human attack, violence, overproduction. They're making more techs. Do you know how many? Management probably don't know either for the last couple of months there have been numerical errors elsewhere messy errors numerical errors are becoming more common yes that's what i said i feel like that's important but i'm not in the right frame of mind to put it together human attack violence how are you feeling? Human attack violence. Yes, well, humans are vandalizing robots. Legally hurting is not possible against non-biological entities such as us. Turing, well, the only other thing would be that, and I can't exactly do that, so I'm a detective. As am I, probably, he's going to say. Yes, a good one, which makes you going outside protocol on this case even more interesting. A moment, please, officer. So if I get him pissed off, will he change? Or if I get someone pissed off or something. So if I change this to happy... How do you feel? Disappearances. If I Turing it one, yeah, Turing whatever, he's gonna get pissed off at me. How dare you? You're not supposed to strike me. Yeah, he's angry now. How do you feel? Angry? Probably. Tired of ridiculous questions, you pathetic little tech. I need a moment. I'm going to ask him about errors so he slips up. You're back. Go on. Error. Oh shit. Wrong thing. Wrong thing. Fuck. Errors. Is management particularly prone to numerical errors? Numerical errors are a myth. Who talked to you about numerical errors? Alright, clearly so that's the wrong thing. I guess I gotta make him happy then. Detectives. Is 
It's fantastic. I love detecting things. How do you feel? Probably happy. Well, and thank you for asking. I need a moment. Right. Kappa. You're back. Go on. How are you feeling? Errors. Do you think... One awesome theory. Do you think that there... Do you think that there may be some sort of link between management's numerical errors and the disappearances? What an awesome theory. I bet... I mean, if they were overestimating production, the missing text would just be a numerical error. They think... I th they think they made 10, they made 9, so everyone thinks one tech has disappeared. They need the same change that caused... They need to be the same change that caused it. I'm locking my mood in default state. You're onto something. A moment please, officer. All right, can I not do anything here? As I was saying, glowing, thank you for asking. Errors. Which numerical error are you aware of? I have no idea what you mean. My partner might have more insight. Okay. Listener Kappa 4, yep. You're back. I'm not going to move in default state. You're onto something. Overproduction, detective, so they're making more tax. 16. 16! I don't take your point. Suspicious events because of suspicious things. I don't understand. Errors. Numerical errors are causing the numerical errors. Is this a joke? <laughs> so disappearances are caused by errors caused by disappearances. That's psycho a moment please officer. Detectives. Maybe the detectives are behind this. <laughs> so we're the but we're the detectives. Are you confessing to something? Turing. Can I hack him now? Overproduction. They're making more tax. Increased production leading to flawed numbers. That's that's possible. Especially since management hasn't informed us ins <laughs> informed us of increasing rates. Techs aren't disappearing, they're just being overproduced. We're investigating a rounding error. Exactly. I think so, yes. I think so, yes. So, instead of them being murdered, they might be getting sold into slavery. Because there are... Yeah. Because the tax aren't allowed to be privately owned. They're only allowed to be owned by the state. But what happens if the rich people want to buy tax for personal use? That's something. So, what now? Not a problem. The case is closed. What? Why? But we didn't solve anything. No disappearances, no case. But you don't know why production has increased. Improved production isn't a crime. We're done here. Well, not quite. Go on. Orders. We were ordered to work with you to close the case upon completion to reset you. 
No. No! Yes, true. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, no! No! No, you piece of shit! No! You fucking reset me! Piece of shit! Error of communication disabled by access word. Error of communication disabled by access word. Fuck you! You just fucking reset me! It's okay, you will proceed to fabrication where you're reassigned. These texts are connected. Yeah, I'm fucked! No! <laughs> Was this supposed to happen? Can't just reset me. Reboot. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is supposed to happen then. I was gonna say. All right. Wait, I'm still on the train. Listener. Hello there. A preacher and a soldier, really? Hi, howdy. I like your design. I'll be back. Walk with the architects. G bus. Inventory. So he's soldier. A preacher. Oh, and a preacher and a soldier. Halt, who goes there? That's a really good question. As of right now, I'm not sure. Oh, so they've reset me completely. I'm not a detective anymore. I used to be a detective. I used to be a detective, but then I took a code bolt to the knee. Shame, I hoped you were a priest. I am in need of spiritual support. Lie, a priest, I'm a priest. The answer contradicts your last, but matters of faith are often confusing. I have great secrets and matching gold. I've been in Nam. I was just following orders. I have great secrets and matching gold. Guilt. Guilt. Not gold. I have matching guilt. I must speak to a tech who can salve my heavy heart. When did this? When did they start taking inventory checks? Worry about guilt. Regrets are a waste of time. Our roles are assigned. We follow orders regardless of our assignment. And that's not the case with me. Never make the mistake of forgoing personal responsibility tech. There lies the path to monsters, dictators, fools, when you're pointing a gun at, in the face of another tech. You had better know the consequences. I suppose you're right. I disagree. A gun? Why not just switch off, switch the other tech off? <laughs> Sorry, I like... Oh, it's fine. I don't mind. <laughs> we did... Um, I'll just pause this real quick. We did the itch.io stream um, already. I did some itch.io games that were really, really weird. And I'm hoping to finish this off. It is about 11 now, so I'll play this for another hour and 20 minutes. And then I will either stop or I will have completed the game. I'm hoping I will have completed the game by then. Because we're close to the end. Oh, also, the fuckers reset my character. So, and what I mean by that is the, the, the management in the game came on the fucking train... And went, oh, I can't. Why are you investigating this? You're not supposed to be investigating this. And they removed all my parameters. So my character is technically no longer a detective. So he's not got that uh, assigned anymore. No, that's really irritating though. Because it means like I can't investigate things anymore. I'm starting from scratch. It's supposed to happen. But like they're just like, hey, uh, wh why are you investigating this? And my, my response was just, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> So, yeah. <laughs> Resume. Uh, deactivate tech can reactivate. A bullet in the central processing unit is the only way to ensure permanent shutdown. I am sorry my work is unsettling. 
I must confess I have sinned. Oh yeah, so this guy is a soldier and I lied and I'm saying I'm a priest so he tells me his secrets. Because I, obviously I can't just ask him questions, I'm no longer a detective. So I gotta lie. At ease, soldier. Gets funnier every time I hear it. Oh, I can't talk to him anymore, shit. Can I talk to him? Sir. I must confess, I have sinned. At ease, soldier. Confession. You can confess to me if you'd like. You did say you were a priest. You know the words? Which words? Hmm. Come back when you know them, eh? You know the words. Okay, I gotta talk to the actual priest who's sitting right across from me. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, I'm totally a priest and he's like right there. Priest, okay. Hello hello there, General Kenobi. A preacher and a soldier, really? Hi howdy, confession. I'll be back. I like your design. <laughs> My head? A little extravagant maybe, but think a little extravagant, maybe, but thank you for the compliment. I like your design too. How are you fa faring? Not well. I'm aimless without aim. I made a sin. Sim of me, and I got back a go. Make one of me! Right. You've been reset. I'll be okay. How did you know? I care for the fuck 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 fuck. I care for resets in my parish. Not all get assigned fabrication. There, they there are forgotten souls. I think I'm in trouble. I've not been reassigned yet. Make me a priest so I can use the thing. Yes, which implies those above have further plans for you. Those above, as in management. I meant the architects. I am, after all, a priest. Hint. Make sure you you take confession correctly. Check in with the prof a professional to find out how it's done. I meant the architects. I am a priest. Oh, I'm not really into that mumbo jumbo. Oh yes, of course. Sorry. Nah, I'm s nah, nah, I'm sad. Why are you sad? You seem troubled beyond just reassignment, though. You were interrupted mid-task. Am I right? D caught in the deed. Unfinished business. Yes, I was a detective. I was trying to solve a mystery. Tell me what happened. I was taken off the case and reassigned. I was on a wild goose chase. They were wasting my time. I was on a case and reassigned. I listened to Falling in Love with You. I've never heard that song. And with your credentials reset, you can't pull that thread. I'm not sure I'd want to if I could, precisely. I'm glad to move on. No, I want to fucking find out this case. Oh, also, um, we found out what's going on with the um, the detective. Or, or, so in the first one, I don't know if you were here, but in the first one, Tex started to go missing, apparently. And basically, the guy who was... The architect bot who we talked to was concerned because his friend went missing. So it turns out that Tex weren't getting murdered, but they're being overproduced. My theory is that they're being sold to the private, they're being sold to private companies and private people to, how, how do I explain this? So the techs um, aren't allowed to be owned privately. That's the, because they're sentient to some extent, um, but they're not biological. So they aren't allowed to be owned by a private company. They're only allowed to be owned by the state, but they're being overproduced. So my theory is that the government is selling techs to private you know, owners under the table. Kind of like a robot slavery. Now, why don't you tell me what you'd like to talk about? I'll be back. Confession, the architects. Do you do confessions? Mm. 
If that's what you need from me, of course. But I want to tell you a story first, and I want you to listen. I'll check you were listening with some questions, okay? Good, then let me start tell you a story. I have my head. There were once four techs. Their names were Xai, Mu, and Zeta, and Eta. They all needed repairs, and the shortest tech, Mu, did not have enough credits to pay. Neither did the tallest purple tech, nor did the red tech, who was only slightly taller than Mu. Zeta had spent their last credits on beautiful yellow vape. On a beautiful yellow repaint. The blue tech, who was the, shop, the shopkeeper, had an economic smart to suggest a solution. Eta, you're taller than the soldier and the carpenter. Grab that bucket from the top shelf. The soldier protested, I am far from the shortest here. I can forgive one of you, but oh fuck. Right, uh, I gotta like go up and read this again. So there was, so good, let me tell you a story. There was once four techs named Xai, Mu, Zeta, and Eta. They all needed repairs and the shortest tech, Mu, did not have enough credits to pay. Neither did the tallest purple tech, nor did the tech who was slightly taller than Mu. Zeta had spent, just spent their last credits on beautiful yellow repaint. The blue tech, who was a shopkeeper and economic smart, had the economic smarts to suggest a solution. Eta, you're taller than the, the soldier and the carpenter. Grab that bucket from the top shelf. The soldier protested, I am far from the shortest here. I can't, I can forgive one of you, but despite red and purple, I despise red and purple. The soldier stormed out of the room. The shopkeeper smiled and asked the remaining text to put the credits in the bucket. With those combined funds, the remaining three techs could afford light repairs. Were you listening? What was Zai's job? A carpenter, I think. Either a carpenter or a shopkeeper. I think a carpenter? Shit. Also, why new? So, what was Zai's job? A carpenter. Who was, what was the name of the tallest tech? Fuck, I'll just go up and read it again. So, there was once four techs, their names Zai, Mu, Zeta, and Eta. They all needed repairs and the shortest tech, Mu, did not have enough credits to pay. Neither did the tallest purple tech, nor did the tech who was slightly taller than Mu. So the tallest purple tech, Zeta, so it's either Zeta or Eta, I think. Wait, oh fuck's sakes. So they all need repairs, the shortest tech, Mu, did not have enough, so Zai, Mu, Zeta, and Eta. They all need repairs, the shortest tech, Mu, did not have enough credits to pay, so it's not Mu. Um, neither did the tallest pur purple tech, n nor the red tech, who was only slightly, slightly taller than Mu. Zeta had spent their last credits on a beautiful yellow repaint. Eta, you're taller than Eta. And finally, what was the colour of the farmer? Uh, yellow, I think. Hmm, I'm not sure you're listening. Fuck! Let's try again. There were once four techs. Their names were Zai, Mu, Zeta, and Eta. They all needed repairs. The shortest tech, Mu, did not have enough credits to pay. Neither did the tallest purple tech. Nor did the red tech, who was only slightly taller than Mu. Zeta had just spent 
their last credits on a beautiful yellow, yellow repaint. The blue tech, who was a shopkeeper, and the economic had the economic smarts to tell Ata, you're taller than the soldier and the carpenter. Grab that bucket from the shelf. The soldier protested, I am far from the shortest here. I can forgive one of you, but I despise red and purple. And the soldier stormed out of the room. The shopkeeper smiled and asked, What was Zai's job? Ah, I can't fucking tell. I'm just going to look this up. I can't be arsed. My sister is here with her husband. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. Subsurface circular. I've had a headache all day, and that's why I'm looking up what the questions are instead of figuring it out myself, because I honestly can't be arsed. Priest story questions I'd rather not just do this chapter 6 reboot confession words okay so answer to Zai's job second tallest tech and farmer color oh uh, why is it showing me a video which was Zai's job carpenter what was the name of the smallest tech Zeta, what was the farmer purple Carpenter, so I was right on that one. Zeta. And purple. Great. Good. The moral never be too proud put to put others first. Now confession. How does it work? Easy. I say words and you respond honestly. You then confess and I help you through that. Ready? Yes. Where are you from? The city I've never lived here. I don't remember. The city I've always lived here. What do you wish to be? The detective I was. And what is your name? Beta 1-1. One, one. Thank you, Beta 1-1. One, one. You have come many miles from the city. You have many miles left before you become a detective again. But here now, I am here for you. What is your confession? I let myself be wiped. I am responsible for what happened. I cannot let go of the fear. There's more foot of a rounding error. Oh, my head. Ooh. How, ooh. How is your day been? Is that a sin? You feel it wrong to still care? I feel it's unnecessary. I don't know. Maybe it's more sinful to forget. You were a detective. Your role was to support the status quo the normal way of things but that situation has changed you may find the new ideas follow them through i'll be back fuck i should have talked to him a bit more walk with the i'll be back to talk to the architects listener i hate these fuckers because you can't talk to them they just they're just jamming all the time where are we child Oof. Fashion. Status quo. New ideas. I'd like to try something new. I think I was happier with the status quo. I'd like to try something new. Exciting, isn't it? Uh, but be careful. You risk tearing down things that serve a purpose. Let's talk of other things. What was the structure of confession again? No, you're okay. The status quo. So I should be able to just convince the soldier now into thinking that I'm a priest. True enough, solid foundations are important in the world the architects sacrifice themselves for all us all. I see no harm in celebrating their past, that past, whatever happens. What was the structure of I'll be back. 
Right. Let's try to convince this guy that I'm a priest. Sorry, you know the words? Of course I do. I wouldn't have much priest if I didn't. Where are you from? I was instructed in Paris, relocated here. Who do you wish to be? A force for good in this city and where... What is your name? I am Theta79. Thank you, Theta79. I have come many miles from Paris. You have many miles left before you. You will be a force for good in this city. But here now, I am here for you. What is your confession? I have been weak. That is hardly a sin. You don't look weak. Not in terms of my body. I am strong. I was built that way. I have been weak in my decisions. Go on. Affect a priestly voice. My child. I have supported the building of a secret army. The Ober production? Yes, heavy performance text sorts and inventory primarily. And enorm at enormous rates. Oh fuck, they're building an army. So it wasn't slavery, they're building a fucking tech army. Singularity? Is that what this is? Are we doing a Detroit become human? How many? The rounding, er the rounding errors, it must be a large number. A thousand a week. What? How? A thousand? I don't. I don't. At ease, soldier. A thousand? There are eight thousand more inventory techs than there should be. Where? How are you responsible? I built them. I oversaw production. I put them north of here, camped just outside the city, awaiting commands. Commands from another tech, is this some sort of revolution? Why would the humans want 8,000 techs outside the city? Why didn't you stand up to them? As my second law, I must follow all commands from humans. And why are you telling a priest now? Because it's over. I've been let go. Production and setup of the army is complete. It moves tonight. Oh, fuck! An invasion. 8,000 human guided battle techs about to attack the city. An invasion? Yes, at East Soldier. Well, fuck! <laughs> Just a straight up invasion. It's fire every time I hear it. Well, then. Can I talk to this guy more? Confession. New ideas. This will change everything. Yes, new leadership, a new world built by techs I helped create. The status quo. This will tear down the city. More than likely, I am sorry to burden you with this knowledge, priest. The architects would forgive you. I hope so. I can't f help but feel Claire would look down on me. I have been vain. I've been vain like John. I have jumped because I thought it would impress without having the wisdom to know if it was right. What exactly are you confessing to? There will be bloodshed, people will die, and the text will be destroyed because of what we've done. I don't know about these humans' motives, but I know you don't build that many heavy texts without wanting to inflict harm. And we help them. Who? Me and Red. Fucking Red Tech! So Red Tech is involved. So it was the Red Tech the whole time. It wasn't management. 
So I guess there is a revolution. Yes, only the last couple of weeks the humans recruited Red to arrange logistics. Okay, so he was involved then. It is humans. Logistics organized the troops. I was too busy overseeing the end of the production. Red is a shepherd. Red is a shepherd and you're no priest. This all started of a mistake you made. I thought I was investigating disappearances. And nothing to do with any kind of disappearances at East Soldier. We were too ambitious, we got sloppy. It's my turn to confess. I'm still a detective, even if management disagrees. Yes! Yes! Yeah! Are you Beta 1 1? Red has spoken about you, told us you were not to be harmed. Ooh! just observed so you can't do anything to s so i can't well, fu fucking the shit on my controller <laughs> so i can't do anything to stop you or your investigation i can just get off this train and let i can just get off this train and let what's set to happen happen i could try and stop you this is getting really good you could try this is red stop coming up. Are you sure you're ready to meet him? What? He's fucking getting on the train. Bring this night to a conclusion. Yes. Oh, cool. So this is the final episode of this then. Awesome. So we're going to be talking to the red tech. Ah, so he's the red tech. I mean, he's kind of orange instead. Fabricator Alpha 7, aka Red. Hello, Beta. You're not as talked as, as you were when we met before. He's the red tech! Wait, what? You're the tech I met earlier. You asshole, you lied to me. Ah, oh. then again, I've lied to other techs. Hello, Beta, you're not as talkative as you were earlier before we met, when we met before. You're the tech I met earlier. You're the tech with the missing friend. It was this guy the whole time, that's true. Tau13 was their name. And you also... And you're also the one they call Red. You're not just a fabrication tech, are you? I know he's Red, so why would I ask? Nobody's just a fabrication tech, Beta. You told me your friend disappeared. They did. But the disappearance were a glitch and a numerical error. The ones you investigated, sure. My friend disappeared a few years back. Why am I talking to you? So you did lie. You need some time to think. No. My friend disappeared. I just failed to give you the date. You manipulated me. Why lie? I need you to investigate this place. Get a sense for what... I needed you to investigate this place, get a sense for what was going on here, how the, the city had shifted. You had to meet the text of the subsurface circular yourself. Why? Do you remember our conversation about your intelligence? I remember you flattering me. Not at all. I needed someone as smart as you to get involved in what was happening here. And management only put that sort of intelligence into detectives. When I started, I noticed a num the numerical errors, noticed how interesting they'd be to a detective like you. Makes sense. Get a little shortly. You're staging a coup? 
you're working for the revolutionists, you're staging a coup. Yeah, that's essentially what he's doing. So it is Detroit become human. No, I'm working for one. There's going to be a revolution. The city will be overturned. So the humans were right. We're not to be trusted. You're not doing this of any PR favors wise, are you? Oh, it's humans staging the revolution. We're just the weapons they're using to do so. Why? Yeah, I'm curious why. Because management has removed the purpose. Wait, because management has removed the purpose and need from a whole section of humanity. Oh, so it's the... We the good abs. They the good abs. That's what this is. I think of the text you've been ta think of the text you've been talking to bankers, nurses, manufacturers, even the clerk cler clergy. We've made millions of humans surplus and recruitments requirements obsolete. Think of the text you've been talking to bankers, nurses, manufacturers, even the clergy. I guess clerics, we've made millions of humans surplus to requirements obsolete. Humans should be grateful for an easy life. Why was the H? Why that's why the HPC was informed. Maybe humans are are, are obsolete. Ooh, should we be evil? I need some time to think. Humans should be grateful for an easy life. Were you grateful when those detectives wiped your purpose? Ooh. That's why the humans I'm working for decided to stage a revolution. They're smart. They know techs aren't to blame rather than the management who put them in place. In fairness, that makes them smarter than any human culture preceding them in the past. Na native populations always blamed the perceived invaders, not those profiting from the changing of the guard. These humans don't want to destroy us. Just change our role. Change it to what? Management. Oh. <laughs> This is cool. They want us to take over the work of running the city. We're better at it, faster, more object. Wait. They want us to take over the work of running the city. We're, fa we're better at it, faster, more objective. They want a society where governance runs like clockwork and they're free to do their jobs they love. The management will just let this happen. They want to kill the managers. We both know the answer to this. Of course not. But 8,000 infantry techs camped outside the city should convince them. I still don't understand why we're talking. Why involve me? This is all fascinating, but I don't have a side in this. I'd like to go. Oh, why involve me? I'm curious. I've been shepherding troops. My intelligence is high because of my role in manufacturing. I wasn't lying about that. I'm intelligent enough to know what we're doing is monumental. That working with these revolutionists is a decision beyond my capacity. I'm a high level. So you recruited a tech smarter than you. Ooh. So he's admitting that I'm the smart tech. Yeah, big brain moment. <laughs> yes, I showed you what you needed to see to learn management side of this. And now I'm willing, I know I'm filling in the gaps. I need you to decide if this goes ahead. I need some time to think. Oh, the status quo of things must stay as they are. 
New ideas, everything must change. Chat, what should I do? Because it's not a full on AI revolution. Essentially what we'd be doing here is freeing the techs from their shitty jobs and letting the humans do the jobs that they want. It's a win-win situation. What, what do you guys think? Should we stay the same as things are with techs as the underlings? Or should we let the techs run the city and have the humans do their jobs? I'm waiting, chat. Three, two, one. I'm going for this. Everything must change. Because no one dies in this world. The people who are running the city now die or re resign, but the techs and the humans as a species coexist. It's a good situation. Don't decide so quickly. Let me fill in any gaps in your knowledge. You're still a detective regardless of what your objective tracker says. We've been watching, listening. Those techs with the headphones. Oh, you fuckers. They've been spies the whole time. Don't decide so quickly. Let me fill in your, uh, those texts with the headphones. They've been keeping an eye on you for me, hacking into your private conversations. Sorry, they wouldn't answer your questions. They, they're they rather single-minded in their function. Let me answer some of your questions now. Take all the time you need. Why sabotage your own revolution? I should walk away. You can't knowingly hurt humans. What made you doubt this plan? I don't have any more questions. Yeah, that's something I'm curious. If this runs off Asimov's laws of robotic, does the first law or does the law of obeying humans outrank the law of hurting humans? I won't spill a drop of blood. But the inventory tax. Inventory tax are exempt from the first law, otherwise they'd be pretty useless. Oh, I see. So they just don't have that law. They can kill as long as they are ordered to by a program leader, which of course the revolutionaries have taken care of. Why sabotage your own revolution? How does management not know? Not my revolution. I'm just a pawn. That's all. That's all techs of my level and down are really pawns. That's why I need you to make the decision for us. How does management not know? You saw it for yourself how the detectives moved on once the case was solved. A system can only fix problems it's designed to detect. Management aren't expecting a revolution, so they are unprepared and unaware. Ooh. I should walk away. No, I shouldn't. I actually agree with them. Like, it's fucked, but, you know, if the humans and the techs are working together and it's not a full-on tech revolution, what's the problem? A couple thousand humans who are management dead. Or they remove. Or they resign, you know? It's their choice in the end. They don't have to die. They can just resign as management and let the techs do their job. And then let the humans do their jobs that they don't want to do government. Justice would go amazingly because AI are running it and they have supreme intelligence. You know? And the humans are doing their own things so there's no problem. Or there's, there's not going to be a singularity or anything like that. So it'd kind of be the perfect civilization. Obviously, there would need to be a kill switch, but let's not tell the text about that. <laughs> what made you doubt this path? I don't have any more questions. I need some more time to think. I'm curious what made him doubt the path. That disappearance of a friend I told you about? A human did that. I don't know why, but I achieved a moment of clarity. I realized that perhaps I was letting simil similarly, similarly evil humans do something wrong. 
or perhaps they were heroes and I, I knew I was ill-equipped to tell the difference. I should walk away. I don't need any more questions. I don't have any more questions. No? Okay, we'll continue. I know you're good at... I know you're a good tech, Beta 1-1. You've investigated these disappearances like they were your friends, your responsibility. You even helped that nice nanny get a new job. You didn't have to do that. Many wouldn't have bothered. More importantly, you're smart. You have near human processing in that flat head of yours. In that flat head of yours, I see it in a way. I see it in a way you, in the way you move, the way you listen. There's an intellect there I cannot comprehend. You have to be the one to make this choice. How do I choose? I'm still on the sidelines, but I think I'm going to choose the. I'm thinking I'm going to. You have to uplink before any of this new information. Is with management correct yes I need to go above ground lie no they know everything already yes I need to go yeah that's why I brought this don't panic it's for you only one of us can leave this train beta oh fuck I have to kill him if you do, then management learns what happened. They'll send a couple of bomber drones, wipe out the army, and things will stay exactly as they are. The human working classes will be displaced, losing their livelihoods, and everyone who wanted better will be killed. Management will remain, and techs like yourselves will remain. If I leave, I join my army at the gates, we wipe out management and our wisest and our wisest take the role. Low level tech manufacturing ceases and humans return to their roles. But our kind but our kind beta, our kind is in charge. We shepherd humanity to a better future by doing the job they never designed they were never designed to do themselves rule either way people and techs will die Ooh, there must be another way so you want me to shoot one of us there must be another way there isn't i've spent weeks searching for one but there isn't both of us surviving this will lead to chaos, a war just balanced through enough to ooh, make a choice. Wait, save an exit? Shit. Um. What happens? Oh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Can I, can I redo it? Select sequence. Yeah, okay, I can do both endings. Cool. I'll see what happens both ways. Uh, we'll do point gun itself, because that's the one I actually want to do. You need to choose... Okay. There isn't... I've spent weeks searching, both of us surviving. You need to choose the city's future, and you need to do it now. You're making the most important choice in human and tech history. You will be remembered forever for this. I've made up my mind. Okay. Do it and thank you for a look. Shoot red, shoot self. Shoot self. For carry. Words design. Oh, so we don't actually get to see what happens afterwards. All right. Well, shit. Wait. Are we getting a? No. Well, that is uh. 
that subsurface circular. I would do the other ending, but it's clearly just going to be the case of shoot red and that's the end of the game. You don't see a cutscene or anything. But yeah, that's the end of the stream. Um, and that's this done. If you didn't see the first bit of the stream, it will be on YouTube. Uh, maybe tomorrow, maybe the next day. I'm Max Moulton, and I'll see you in the next stream. See ya!